welcome back to the channel and we are changing something real quick for the G37 I don't hide anything uh, some people do uh, I think I've mentioned it before I'm using spacers on my workmeisters due to the face being low disc remember these wheels used to be on a 350Z so it's a different fitment than the G37 and I'm only using spacers on the front ones one of the threads over here gave out, so I need to switch it. I got a new one. Went ahead and got spacer for it. And we got the lug nut as well. So we got this. Uh, these are 25 millimeter spacers at the front just to achieve that fitment fender to lip on these carbon fiber fenders. So we're gonna be doing this right now, super quick, switch it up, and then yeah now i got a chance to show you guys really what happened to my exhaust now that the car is up on the jack so there it is that's my issue right there so no hangers clamp is out gave up it doesn't work anymore so yeah hangers are supposed to be here today and that is what we have all right, that being said, you guys know how to change spacers. Pretty simple, just remove this. We got the spacer over here, so time to change it out. Awesome, so let's go ahead and start removing all of this, put in the new one, and we should be good to go. And yeah, I just want to mention this for those that don't know, I also have a video on my YouTube channel. We have two-piece rotors from C1 Motorsports, super expensive. We have the ones at the front, and we have them at the back as well. Super light, they do the job. We have the new spacer ready to go nice and tight so for those that are changing a spacer or anything and if this is moving around what can you guys do if the car's up just put a flathead inside the caliper so this one doesn't move at all just a quick tip let's do this we changed the plans a little bit so I guess uh, Rudy is coming over here first uh, to fix my my exhaust and put my hangers that being said i'm just waiting on him and we can start lifting up the car might as well just start doing it lift up the car have the car ready so we can just go ahead and put everything on yeah so that being said it's just trying to get the car fixed um like i told you guys we have just back in la convention center so let's get ready for that so after this installing the hangers and stuff like that i'll think about it if i can head over to Eddie's and you know record a little more content and stuff like that we will see you got the Q50? yeah Rudy really got the Q50 the still what? I sent it like 15 minutes ago. that's crazy so right now we're just taking care of uh, the exhaust the car ready for if you ask the just bag that's another show is that the show that Eddie's, Eddie's trying to go to also I think so that's what he's trying to do he, says he wants to put the car on display yeah you wanna get W40 see you I have some give me a sec you need a right no, it's just that I'm not putting it a lot. Okay. Yeah, he was saying he's trying to put just the motor on this plate. Yeah, the motor on this plate. That should be tight. I'm like, just for me, fine. Just do it. So, you have a 13? You take this one? Uh, 13 millimeter. Yeah. Second. Yeah, the motor drain is cool, but the fucking the clamps go out, huh? Yeah, the clamps are garbage. That's why I got those.
Oh, there's a GTR at my job that I want to buy. Dang. It's just one, two. Is there any one in the front? Not the front, I think you replaced it, no? I think. I replaced, uh, yeah. I replaced a couple of them. Yeah. Alright, cool. Alright, so we just fixed the clamp for the exhaust on the Motodyne. It's ready to go, so I just want to say a huge shout out to Rudy. He came, up, he came down and bring the the clamp for the G37. All right, so right now I'm just gonna clean everything just a little over here and then I'm gonna head over there just trying to record more content for you guys and show you like the motor that they're working on. All right, we're pretty much done. Where's Mayo? We are back checking out the twenty thousand dollar motor. Some of the greedy, huh? That's wonderful. Stuff over here. Mark. Where are these ones at? That's the aluminum one. Two hundred bucks, So that's it over here. Eddie's trying to make it to what's the show? Just back. What's it called? Probably. Is it just back or just creamy? Just back. Had creaming. So he's thinking about taking just the motor, parking the car, so just showing it off and stuff like that. Other than that, that's it. Building twin turbo. We are back in my garage, pretty much done with the video. Uh, remember, this video drops Sunday, which is tomorrow for you guys. And we have next week, the 22nd, uh, just back in LA Convention Center. And I also, I'm going to be receiving a, another screen for a 350Z. So we're going to be doing the install for Nifty City. Stay updated for that video, it is coming. I'll be uploading to YouTube. And yeah, that being said, for those people that are going to just bag show in LA, if you guys are going, say what's up, say hi. And also a quick update, we have the new uh, drop coming in for Rare Origin which is this one. I recently went and took some pictures, video and everything. So pretty much we are ready to drop this shirt. Stay updated for that. It's going to be available on the website. So I'll see you guys next show. If you guys go, say what's up and I'll catch you guys later. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and I'll see you guys soon.